Another Vo chief gave special permission to. Just past here is the Gerdo Shelter. May have the chief's favor, but that doesn't mean you can do whatever you want. You still need to obey the rules. Where did the owner... Oh, you're the chief's guest. Hmm, so this is a bow. His ears look to be about. And the circumstance... The circumference of his head? Neck? Interesting. Oh, I'm sorry. You're the first bow I've ever seen. I got a little carried away figuring out your measurements. Why was I doing that? Because I make accessories. And the key to any good accessory is the perfect fit. My name is Kara. I haven't had a lot of opportunities to make accessories for a bow. So if you give me the chance, I'll put everything I've got into making some really great ones for you. Mm. If the shop's owner were here, he probably could have made you all sorts of things. But she went out to look for potential adornments and hasn't come back since. He was in such a high spirits too, gushing about all the treasure she'd find around the Bermuda Dunes. That's a dangerous place, though. Walduga territory. I hope she didn't run into trouble. Oh. Anyway, did you need something? The owner may not be here, but I'll do what I can. What do you want? I'm I'm busy right now, okay? I need to make sure the bow my dreams hears all my feelings for him. But how can I properly focus the positive energy or put the bottles in the water while the, this guy is loitering around? Uh -huh. Get out of here! Scram! What you got? Alien rice, rock salt, fill no, 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 no. Why are you following me? Hey, so you're a special bow, aren't you? Otherwise, the soldiers would be arresting you right now. So, why are you so you special? Yeah. Hey, Dahlia, you better not be speaking to that bow. Didn't Miss Ash Ashiai teach you the first rule about bow? For young Via, speaking with a bow will only invite misfortune. <laughs> I'm not talking to the bow. I'm just talking. I can't even see. So it's not my fault who comes walking by. Oh. Well, that doesn't make any sense. Oh. Listen up, Bo. You shouldn't go poking your nose into Gerudo life. You're free to come and go as you wish. But please don't disrupt the peace of this town. Who was that? Vault fruit. I that special bow the guards are talking about. My name is Ashiai. I'm in charge of teaching the bow and you class to the Gerudo. <laughs> Have you set your heart on someone special? Uh. Oh, is that right? Don't, don't let love pass you by. Things just kind of sparkle when you're in love, you know? <laughs> you're welcome to sit in on a lesson if you're interested. Bo aren't normally allowed in town, so it would be a rare treat for the class if you showed up. Maybe you could come by in the evening. The class is for the older Gerudo. The daytime class is for the younger students. I don't think they're quite ready to meet a bow. <laughs> Sometimes I think about the students that recently graduated from this class. They're set out to explore the world and possibly find a bow of their dreams. But they aren't exactly seasoned travelers. I hope you're, they're okay. Last I heard, they were near Outskirts Stable. 
I'm sure everything is going fine. Man. I don't want to know what the dialogue says if you say yes, you found somebody you love. Good God, how big is it? How big is this place? Valley of Silent Statues? <sighs> Nothing like going to stretch your legs and ending up in the strangest place. Everything looks the same down here. It would be so easy to get turned around. I wonder if the people who originally made this place got lost in it all the time too. What do you want? Were you lurking in the shadows there? Eavesdropping on what I was saying? Oh, you're the bow that everyone has been talking about, right? If I were younger, I might have been surprised to see you here. But at my age, well, very little surprises me. Disappointed that I wasn't shocked and aghast at the very sight of you, eh? Anyway, I'm going to go. I'm feeling a little parched, so maybe something to drink at the canteen. Well, that was unexpected. Okay, we've got... I think that's sand, not water. Yes. Right there on the rock. Hmm. <laughs> 
definitely something there. Look at his chest. Yep. Arrows. Is this? Palm fruit. Okay. Bunch of those mirror things around. Okay. Just need to find one that I'm able to move. I think twit. Gibbo bone. Creepy bone with multiple sharp tips. Attach it to a weapon to greatly increase the attack power. It tends to break easily due to the odd shape. Gibbo guts.
Okay. We don't have enough bonds for that. But if I'm thinking correctly, but that's light. Is she here? Do we want to go talk to her already? I don't. I want to try to figure this cave out a little more first. There's gotta be a reflective glass, a mirror around here somewhere. Right? may have been a mistake to come back. There might not be anything we can do here. Oh, maybe? What is this? Some more bombs? Well, there's two more bombs at least. Alright. There it is. I know there was a third one. I don't know if we're going to be able to get access to it. Where exactly is it again? Just find this wall. Yes. 
So without another reflector, another mirror. Not that I mind there being frog dude, but I was hoping for a little something else. There must be another mirror around here somewhere. There's a fan. I'm back. Am I really about to have this problem again? Damn, aren't
that might work. I don't know. At least I've got light over there. If I pick this one up, I should be able to do it. It's an electric one. And they're coming out. That's not what I want. That's not what I want.
Chalk like stone. Chalk like stone. Gerudo shield. Topaz. 